All right, so James and I hacked together um, this rocket stability test rig, um, maybe in like, what, an hour or two, if that. Um, and so what it does is it spins the rocket so that um, we can make sure that at low speeds when it's coming off of the, uh, the launch rod that it is going to be stable enough. If it's not stable when it comes off the, off the uh, launch pad, then it could go in any kind of random crazy direction. So go ahead, James. Let's go ahead and test uh, test Les's rocket. And slowly ramp up so it doesn't jerk the rocket around in the initial startup. And we have it crank up to a preset mass. Now, when the rocket is stable, it should point itself directly in its in the direction of the airflow. If it's unstable, it'll start to twist itself while it goes. So right now, it looks fairly stable. But at lower speeds, it starts to become unstable. It's these lower speeds that we're worried about. We have a discussion of a future rocket competition coming up. And this is going to be how we qualify rockets before launching out of safety concerns. So, yeah, it's kind of tumbling there. Now, of course, any rocket going fast enough will become stable. But if it's unstable at launch, it may never actually get to a point where it can go fast enough. As an unstable rocket will tumble head over heels constantly, which depicts its speed to a certain limit. Let's uh, let's take this up to scary speeds. Yep, and it's missing the steps. Yeah, that's good. I've had enough fear. Yep. So that that's it. Electronics part of this. Um, we have an Arduino with a stepper motor controller. And um, that's hooked up to a power supply over there on the on the bench. Uh, there's a stepper motor, and um, then in James' hand, um, you just have a little potentiometer, which is hooked up to the Arduino, and that's uh, that's what's uh, adjusting the speed. Um, pretty simple code, and we get uh, pretty good variable, nice smooth increase in speed. And uh, there, there's a few more things we're we've been talking about uh, doing and some modifications to the hardware and the code to, to uh, add some more features, but this is the, the basic part of it there.